And now it's time for Bum Reviews with Chester A. Bum. Tonight's review... Monsters vs. Aliens. This was a thoroughly enjoyable film with good animation, decent writing, and very good amounts of 3D production. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Oh my god, this is the greatest movie that I personally have ever seen in my entire life. Oh my god, this film, this epic masterpiece, is the greatest film that we as humans have ever produced and I have ever seen in my entire life. I mean Zowie! How was that? Uh, description? Uh, there is a woman who grows to be very large. She is hit by a meteorite that contains all sorts of scientific supernatural powers. And thus she is taken to a secret government location where she... Well, big monstrous things happen. When I say monstrous, I mean monstrous, real monsters. There is a big blue blob that looks like Crest Sparkle toothpaste. A cockroach man. Now, I, I tell you, that's just silly. The missing link between man and fish, I suppose. And they're out to stop an evil alien that has four eyes. Four eyes. <laughs> Who would imagine that? And I guess I don't want to give anything else away. Apparently I do want to give everything else away. All right. The gigantic woman goes inside the giant spaceship and stops the evil aliens from taking over the world, and thus everything is returned back to normal. Well, what else do you want from me? Do you want me to just reenact the whole thing? Oh. She goes into the giant spaceship, runs! L l lots of running. But the alien entraps her in this laser cage. But she breaks out of the cage and suddenly she is shrunken down to her normal size. Oh no! So the other monsters hop on board to try and save her. But she ends up saving them by being small and then suddenly becoming large and then becoming small again. No, no, wait, that didn't happen. She was originally large, then she became small, then she becomes large again. No, no, I mean, she wasn't born large, that so one logically makes sense. Okay, so she starts off small, becomes large, gets small, then becomes large again. I never realized how complex this movie was. So she blows up the ship, or however that sound effect goes, and they are all falling to their deaths. Major distress. But then Insectosaurus comes, because now he is a butterfly. Oh, wait a minute, I didn't tell you about Insectosaurus, did I? All right, let me go back to the beginning. No, no, oh, no, 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 oh. no, 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 no. Wrap up, okay. So, they all live happily ever after. I stole my 3D glasses because I am thoroughly a horrible person. And then I came home and masturbated. Would you like a reenactment of that? No, 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 no. This is that guy with the glasses saying, change. Change is a pass. Oh. Change. Change is a us. Oh, um. Change. You got change. Somebody must have changed. Well, I can't just flat out do an impression of him. I'm no good at impressions. What, you want me to do something like, um. Change! You got change! Oh, come on, have a guy out, will you? Come on, change! Is that what you would like? Well, no. I'm not gonna do it. Piss off! I'm going to go masturbate. And I won't be thinking of you for long.